So a big buzz term right now in the hair world is sulfate. What is a sulfate and why do we need a sulfate-free shampoo or why do we need a sulfate-free uh, conditioner? A sulfate is a surfactant. It's not a big deal. It's what they add to detergents. It's what they add to soaps that cause them to fizz up and foam up and make us feel super clean. Uh, I know I always feel like when I'm washing my hands, if it doesn't foam up, my hands really didn't get clean. That's not really the case. Why might you not want to use them on your hair? They tend to strip our hair. They also um, cause the cuticle on your hair, which is the protective outer layer, to expand, leaving you susceptible if you have color-treated hair to fading um, and your color actually leaving the hair. Um, another reason why you don't want to use a sulfate is if you have curly hair that's susceptible to frizz, if you don't keep enough natural oils in there to keep it shiny and healthy and defined. So in particular, people who color their hair or people who have curly hair don't use a sulfate. My favorite professional uh, sulfate-free shampoo, however, is actually the Living Proof Restore line. Getting a lot of press these days, Jennifer Aniston represents this line. Who doesn't want to have hair that looks like Jennifer Aniston's? All their shampoos are sulfate-free, but this one in particular really does a good job of coating the hair and protecting it, so I would recommend this one highly. But more importantly, sulfates, are they really that bad for us? Not really. But are they bad for our hair? Absolutely. So no matter who you are, steer clear of those sulfate products.